Okay guys, time for a bit of shameless self-promotion. This, this my friends, this hard piece of work, Aaron and I have spent over two years crafting our first official hardcover cookbook on pre-sale now available on Amazon and wherever books are sold. Seems like it's everywhere, which is surreal. It's crazy, so exciting. I literally spent the whole morning texting everyone I know individually saying thank you for the support these last few years. You guys are followers who literally built our following, who literally built this book, you guys. So please go and pre-order the book, the happy, healthy, plant-based cookbook. You guys, it is here, 75 colorful recipes to nourish your whole body, feed your family, and to have fun along the way. We're gonna have fun today because I'm making a couple of epic, epic recipes. These are so, so good. They've become fast favorites of ours and they will for you guys too. So let's get into it. So you guys have seen me do a few of these chefy style videos. If you know Erin, you know that she loves smoothies, salads. She loves her raw foods her raw days of eating. You can find plenty of those here on the channel. But when it comes to dinner time and more cooked recipes, seems like I'm usually the cooked guy. So we're gonna do two awesome recipes for you guys today. I'm gonna do like a cold pasta salad that's a perfect lunch for any time of year. And then I'm gonna do some amazing tacos. I'm starving as we speak, so I'm gonna be really excited to chow down on both of these. The kids are gonna be excited too. Who doesn't love noodles, right? Tacos, noodles, these are gonna be amazing for the whole family any time of year. So let's get started by quickly mentioning what I always mention, and that is mise en place. So Aaron and I have done some amateur style cooking courses, and actually Aaron's taken some legit raw cooking courses, but we always learn from real chefs about mise en place. So this is basically having your stuff in place. So a nice sharp chef's knife, which we highly recommend. It's an investment that will hopefully last you a lifetime, a really good cutting board. I made this cutting board with my own hands back in Nebraska from walnut probably 10 years old and again will hopefully last me a lifetime and then we start setting our food out i have a compost plate with the scraps that i'm chopping and then i have a clean plate to put my ingredients in the pan scraps go here my chopped veggies go here and i feel very organized again i'm going to set everything out probably rinse it beforehand. So for this recipe and all recipes, I highly recommend all organic. Aaron and I have been organic plant-based eaters now for 10 years and it's so, so important. That's a topic for a different video, but most of you probably know and understand the importance of organic ingredients. Besides tasting better, they are just better for you. So for this recipe, you're gonna need one box of organic gluten-free pasta. We like brown rice and or lentil noodles. You're gonna need a couple handfuls of cherry tomatoes and some garlic. I'm also gonna add some broccoli to this recipe. I'm gonna start by sauteing my garlic in a pan with just a little bit of vegetable broth. Then I'm gonna add my broccoli, probably put the lid on for just a few minutes to let this broccoli soften up. And then I'm gonna chop and throw my cherry tomatoes in the pan just to cook them down. At the same time, I'm gonna boil my pasta. So this is all cooking at the same time. And then I'm gonna move on to our sauce. So I'm gonna rinse our can of beans and add them to a small blender, like our Nutribullet. Then I'm gonna add about a cup of soy milk. We prefer soy milk because it's got the healthy fat, it's got all the protein, and the kids actually enjoy the taste. Then I'm gonna add some salt, some pepper, some garlic powder, and our nutritional yeast with a few cashews, and I'm gonna blend this up into a salty, savory, protein-rich white sauce. This is gonna be so good. When my noodles are done, I'm gonna rinse them, add them to a large mixing bowl with my sauteed veggies on top, pour over the sauce, stir it up, and serve it either warm or cold. This is gonna be amazing leftover for lunch tomorrow. Like I said, this is gonna be amazing cold. I don't know why I'm looking forward to this cold. 
It's so delicious. It's amazing warm right now, but I just feel like this is gonna make for awesome leftovers. The kids are digging in right now, also loving it. You guys are gonna love this too. This is going in our app. If you guys don't already have the app, join the eMoveresk membership for 89 bucks. You get every ebook we've ever made, access to our app. We do live calls every Friday with the community, Facebook groups, so much value, and all the best recipes. Lunch is done, and now I'm gonna play Mr. Rogers. Would you like to check the mail with me? This legitimately sh just showed up and I think I know what it is, and it's perfect for this video. You guys know that we, oh yeah, we love Compliment. You guys know we've been using Compliment for years. They've got all kinds of new products, which are really exciting new products for her. There is so much in here. The Daily Essential is the one that I've been taking for years and absolutely love it. So I'm here talking about how to eat a well-rounded plant-based diet, but it's so important to make sure you have your bases covered. I love that Compliment Essential has the eight things that you need that you may want to supplement if you're on a plant-based diet. B12, D3, EPA, DHA, iodine, K2, zinc, magnesium, and selenium. I'm not supplementing, I'm complementing my robust diet. Seriously, love this, you guys. I'm not gonna say think about it, I'm gonna say just order some if you haven't already, because this stuff is legit. The days of droppers and pills and potions and then having neon pee because I'm taking too much of a multivitamin are over. Like I said, I'm getting what I need and nothing extra. So that's super exciting. I'm gonna put that aside. And now we're gonna get started on our dinner recipe. The kids love tacos. In fact, I'm guilty of taking the kids out both separately on little daddy and me dates for tacos. We always get tacos. They're fun to eat. They're delicious. And these are highly nutritious. For this recipe, you're going to need your favorite tortilla. I just buy whatever I can find that's organic. And then I always like to throw them on our griddle. Simple things like heating and or browning your tortillas can make or break a recipe in my opinion. So for this recipe, you're going to need one large or two medium orange sweet potatoes, one red onion, a head of cauliflower, one bell pepper, and one can of chickpeas. I'm also gonna slice and dice some fresh avocado to go on top of these, maybe a lime, some fresh cilantro, and a side of rice wouldn't hurt either. This is so, so good, but the coolest part is how easy it is. What I'm gonna do is chop all of these things, put them on a baking sheet lined with parchment. I might soak them a little bit with some vegetable broth and or barbecue sauce. If you like spicy, you could mix in some sriracha. I'm gonna keep these kind of plain, mostly for the kids. So I'm gonna throw all of this into the oven for about 20, 25 minutes until they're soft, maybe a little bit crispy. We're gonna pull them out and fill our browned tortillas. And then I'm gonna top it with our favorite cashew cream. I just soak about a cup of cashews, again, some nutritional yeast and salt, and it looks, tastes like cheese, it's creamy, it's delicious. We're gonna top the tacos with this, maybe throw some fresh cilantro on top, again, another crack of salt, maybe a squeeze of lime. These are gonna be epic. Feel free to obviously top with fresh tomatoes, roasted corn, and or some rice on the side. Cannot wait to dig into this one. All right, you guys, taste test time. These are loaded tacos, and they are mm, 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 mm. so good. If you guys are digging on this recipe and you want more like it, definitely join the membership. All of our recipes are in the app, and there are so many more to come in January. If you pre-order our book, you guys, this is epic. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Much love, you guys. We'll see you next week. Peace. Mm -mm -mm.